Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? Welcome to my Fallout 76, my sock video. <laughs> I don't even know how to call it. But anyway. I actually wanted to cover this because I actually found this uh, inside the vault pretty interesting and I got a couple ideas with uh, what I think maybe I'm not sure if that's gonna be exactly the way it is and I do apologize that I'm not showing the gameplay as I usually do so I just wanna just straight up jump right into it uh, so they have shared some screenshots with us Bethesda uh, on what they're working for for the Apple for the Wastelanders DLC right so I really hope that they're gonna do it right and uh, it's gonna like have less bugs since they've delayed it and uh, I hope this uh, the first step so anyway as you can see we got here uh, some nasty looking church and it's mentions cultists before I start providing my feedback here what I really loved about everything is the section where they mention where is it weapons new enemies I read ah there you go so new weapons and enemies <laughs> so that that I found this really really cool well not counting the NPCs right like this guy his name is more <laughs> by the way for those who do not know the sale is up uh, with a 25% discount at the legendary vendor I already mentioned this a couple of times so I'm pretty sure most of you are already aware of this one so just coming to think about like having in mind enemies right and then you take a look at the screenshot right here so what I think it's not like a, a location with maybe with some psychopath NPCs that are gonna give you some crazy quests or dailies or whatever but I was thinking from another perspective sort of like enemies like cultist enemies and then we can see over here like like a group of raiders uh, have established in this area so maybe it's gonna be a faction of raiders with NPCs or maybe it's actually gonna be like the bad raiders that you gotta shoot as an enemy so that's gonna be cool uh, so yeah I'm really curious or maybe these are gonna be factions by the way this is just an idea I was just born in my head right now like for example the crazy cultist faction uh, the raider faction and the settlers faction because this is what I think here in this screenshot it's like uh, head beneath uh, the earth to explore Vertoga underground right so I have high hopes here because as we can see there is a robot over here and uh, definitely not an NPC <laughs> I hope <laughs> but what I was thinking maybe this is gonna be finally the dungeon that we want like the hardcore dungeon not with timers not with radiation but real hardcore dungeons when you where you pretty much don't one shot every enemy and you gotta work as a team you need uh, like healers so you'll need a, a healer build you'll need a tank build you'll need the DMG builds you know four people can get in uh, let's say there's a power armor he's more of a tanky guy so he takes all that all those <laughs> shots right at him uh, then the, the medic you know using the legendary weapon such as medic you heal the entire group once you initiate critical hits or the flamethrower through perk cards for charisma and at the end like two I don't know one junkie and one bloody bill just smashing everything they see <laughs> I mean that would be really cool because a real hardcore dungeon like like any other MMO has right like World of Warcraft ESO uh, ESO veteran dungeon I used to love those because they were extremely hard you know that would be cool I mean I I still didn't like that raid thingy uh, that they made it's timer radiation maybe I'm wrong maybe I should give it a try now uh, I've been I've been wanting to try the uh, the raid vault for the past weeks but I just didn't have the time to do it uh, now with the, also the private servers here uh, they're sort of more stable sort of <laughs> uh, we still get freezes kickouts and so on so but anyway I still want to give it a try maybe something will work out uh, but this is what I personally think 
<clears throat> specifically about this screenshot right here and I really hope that that's gonna be the thing once again this is not something that is written here it's just my personal thinking and I really hope that this would be something like a dungeon <laughs> please <laughs> I want a hard dungeon where you gotta collab and not just try to run through the thing because there's a timer ticking you know uh, but you actually like gotta focus build a strategy bam 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 mini boss bam bam and a big boss bam <laughs> you know something like that that'll be cool like without timer like so you can stay in that dungeon for as long as you like <laughs> until you complete it or you die <laughs> so pretty much like this is my thinking that would be really cool by the way I would really want a, a really good dungeon so over here these could be either factions with NPCs and maybe daily uh, quests or even some new vendors because new weapons are coming right so maybe we're gonna have a new set of uh, uh, here's another quick tip on top I mean not tip on top my bad uh, the thing is I don't watch data mine videos I don't I stay away from like uh, any kind of like like you know data mine videos that oh that might gonna come uh, so I have no idea what's over there unless if I find out by mistake uh, when somebody mentioned it on the stream for instance so I have no idea what weapons are coming but it would be cool if there would be like a new set of cultist weapons for example right for melee builds I think cultists like more of dagger style so maybe uh, a more melee uh, weapons are gonna come to the game raiders some raider uh, armor some raider, I don't know, weapons. Uh, actually, well, raiders use whatever, right? <laughs> so they are raiders. They kill, scavenge, move on. <laughs> All right, and uh, the settlers. Personally, I think that this is not going to be like uh, filled with new enemies because it looks really nice, well developed. Because look, like. like uh, fountain settlers have discovered a cave where they can take cover from scorch beasts and make plans to rebuild Appalachia. So, like, if I think about it, what? Well, I would say this is gonna be like a new vendor location, like with a lot of shops. Uh, maybe would be cool if we would have the ability to create clans <laughs> or guilds call it what you want to call it I remember there were some games where you could rent uh, like a shop and you could sell and buy you know so that would be cool if if you hire an NPC and you tell them hey dude sell this stuff buy this stuff for this amount of money for this amount of money well caps right <laughs> that would be cool yeah but personal thinking is like this is gonna be a uh, well populated area in terms of quests and vendors but once again I don't know because <laughs> uh, this is just things maybe that I want or first impression call it but this is what I sort of feel when I see the screenshot so what do you think by the way comment down below what do you want <laughs> comment down below and the uh, ghouls I believe this is well this is gonna definitely gonna be an NPC so we're gonna have talking ghouls especially more maybe he's gonna be uh, I don't know some dude <laughs> <laughs> oh my Adam shot video is ready gotta upload it so yeah this is what I think it is so I did mention about guns etc and they said that they were to share some more information in regards to the uh, to the DLC uh, closer to like New Year's I believe somewhere it was uh, new thing, thing, thing. no I don't remember I read that somewhere or ah yeah there you go in New Year to show you what we have and been working on so they want to show some more information about it as well I mean this will be really nice if they actually keep us posting and actually maybe even sh throw in some actual gameplay screenshots that'll be nice cuz I don't know you can hire a designer and draw this you know <laughs> so, let's let's just uh, let's just hope that this is this is what we want 
well, I, this is definitely what we want. We want more, co more new content, you know, more new stuff, more guns. I'm, a, I'm actually hyped about new guns, new enemies, and I really like my top feature would be, like, even above NPCs. My top feature would be a really good hardcore dungeon, like I. In my priority, because uh, I've been playing since beta and I kind of got used to the world without NPCs. Although, don't get me wrong, NPCs will be fun. But a really good hardcore dungeon, I think that would be really nice when you can, like, where I said, where you need a team, you need a strategy, you know, you need, like, specific sets. Like, let's say, for example, like, this is robot thing, right? You gotta get whatever, uh, at, uh damage reduction from robots right i think there are such yeah from robots there are uh, such legendary effects on um, armor you know make us value those effects because i don't value those effects like oh minus 15 percent from super minus 15 percent from robot you know minus 15 percent from animals <laughs> uh maybe with the hardcore dungeon those sort of sets will have a bigger value because you're not going to get killed or uh, for, for a tank that's gonna be even better thing and you know well I just wanted to share this with you so <laughs> what do you think of my thinking <clears throat> and I'm super curious to find out what are, are your thoughts that's pretty much it and once again in case if you haven't watched the atomic shop video uh, that I've uploaded today I highly recommend to get the Fancy bar set. It goes with a discount. It's a really good one. You got three types of chairs: a table, a bar, and uh, a wall decor, like fill action, whatever it's called. I, I do recommend. This is like, uh, you know, you know me and my attitude to items. But when I like say I recommend it, I mean it. <laughs> I really mean it. Plus, you know, I bought it on a full price back in the day. I think we got it like during Easter time or something like that. Anyway, this is where we're going to be calling at the end for this episode. So, Z Clan, everybody else, you know the drill. Don't forget to leave that like, comment down below. Please do not use profanity as those comments are not visible to other users. And, uh, yeah, <laughs> man, I've been talking too much. Please do not use profanity because they're. Those comments are not visible to other users. I can read them, but I delete them. Have a mind. And don't promote third-party websites that sell guns, caps, services, whatever for real money. That is something I do not support, so you will get banned. That, that I don't know. I'm tired. <laughs> anyway, I hope you sort of enjoyed my thoughts. If you're new and you're subscribed, welcome to Z Clan. I'm GamerZSol, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye.